Hello My name is Dr. Masharuddin Abdul Wahab, consultant obstetrician and gynecologist for Damai Service Hospital. So today, I'm going to talk about the talk of pregnancy. I have heard a lot about this from my friends, my relatives, so let's talk about it. A woman should eat for two when pregnant. Yes, this is very true. A woman may need to increase their calorie intake slightly when they are pregnant, but they must avoid overeating. Overeating can be very harmful to the fetus and also to the mother, especially when the diet contains a lot of empty calories. So they should aim to gradually increase in calories throughout the pregnancy. For example, during the first trimester, actually no extra calories are necessary. They must add another 350 calories per day during the second trimester and continue to increase about 450 calories during the third trimester. Morning sickness only occurs in the morning. Actually, morning sickness uh, can affect pregnant women throughout the day. Less than 2% of uh, pregnant women experience morning sickness only in the morning. So, morning sickness basically uh, can occur uh, by the fourth week and then it will end by the 16 weeks. The shape of your belly can predict the gender of your baby. Carrying low, legends say you are having a boy. If your belly is higher up, it's a girl. Actually, stomach muscles stretch with subsequent pregnancy. So if woman's belly a bit higher up, this probably means that she has a strong abdominal muscle or it could be her first pregnancy. Spice during pregnancy can cause blindness in the babies. Actually, eating spicy foods during pregnancy is perfectly safe, but sometimes it can cause heartburn. So you must ask your doctor if you have indigestion problems and then get the safe antacid to relieve that symptoms. Heartburn means that the baby will have a lot of hair. A small study found that women with mild to severe heartburn can give birth to baby with hair. But then the researchers say that this is most likely connected between the pregnancy hormones which relax birth part of the lower esophagus and being responsible for this. But more research is needed to prove this. Being a pregnant can be really stressful, so definitely don't add any stress to yourself. Any question, just ask your doctor. We were there to help you. We want to know what you are thinking, what you are worried about. So we are going to give you a truth. We are going to give you the right answer. 